Hey preppers, this is your anonymous prepper talking to you, saying hi to you again. I'm getting ready to get out of the house for a little while for another break. I'm a caregiver, as I told you. I just want you to take a look at some of the meals that I prepared for my mom of 93, so that while I'm away, she will enjoy a nutritious, well-balanced meal for six days. This is a six day preparation, y'all. And I believe it looks better than anything I could have gotten from Red Lobster, Olive Garden, all those different places I'm pouring my money into, but the meals just don't taste the same anymore. I made all these meals from scratch, y'all. I have everything from macaroni and cheese, sweet potatoes, fresh salad, garden salad on each one, I have roast chicken, mushrooms and onions, green beans, broccoli, stuffing. I even have stuffing on here. I have salmon on here. All of this was made fresh. I tasted all of it, you guys. This is what you do when you have to prep, when you have to care for your mom, when she's in your care, in your home, under your roof. Everybody didn't get a chance to put their moms in those assisted living facilities for care away from home. Some people just don't have that uh, in their budget. So the next best thing, I'm not putting my mother out to the curb. So this is what I do. And then I take time for myself. And this is what I do when I'm getting ready to go away. I prepare. Those that step in, my other son, my daughter-in-law, all they'll have to do is check on my mom, make sure that she's doing well while I'm away, taking a time away from all of this. I don't know about everybody else, but it's real important to take care of yourself first. When they say you need to, as a caregiver, put on your oxygen mask first, that's exactly what you need to do. I'm taking a stroll in the yard because it's peaceful. Finally, it's peaceful out here. I haven't done anything this season because it was extremely hot. I went from telling you about the meals I'm preparing to showing you the beauty of nature because they're all connected. It's all connected. Look at this butterfly. Is he not gorgeous? Does he not put joy in your heart? Yes, indeed. I didn't do much out here, but it's gonna be all right in the morning. It's gonna truly be all right. Next season, I'm gonna change this entire flower. All of these beds are gonna be changed out. It's going to be gorgeous. This summer was a wash because it was too hot for anybody with a brain to come out here and do anything. But praise the Lord. It is well. I had a few cucumbers in my garden. I shared those with you earlier. I didn't have a bumper crop like I thought, but... There's always next season. We just gonna see what the end brings. Meanwhile, I'm getting ready to go pack my bags and I am getting out of here for a couple of days. Six days is good for me right now. Every time I go away, it's gonna be more and more days. As long as I got it lined up here at home, I recommend all caregivers to put it on your calendar. It's time to get away sometimes. Nobody's gonna tell you that either. You have to know it in your spirit. I know full well when it's time for me to get away. The joy of the Lord is my strength and I was losing my strength. I was losing the joy of the Lord. Oh no, it's time to get away. It's plain and simple. You gotta do it.